Alright guys, once again we are back. We are still continuing to look at the new animatronics from Spirit Halloween for the 2022 Halloween season. I'm getting more excited as we go on. I've only looked at three of these so far. I think this is going to be the fourth one. And today we are looking at the six foot bog zombie animatronic. What in the world? That thing looks, well, no, I was going to say it looks like the creature from the Black Lagoon, but it doesn't really. It just reminds me because of the name bog zombie. So let's go ahead and look at this thing. It looks like something that's coming out of the swamps of Louisiana. And I've been there and I can tell you there's lots of swamps in Louisiana. Okay, let's go down here and read a little bit of this description. It says, in the 1930s, an evil headmaster ran a privately owned orphanage known as the Bayou Children's Home in Louisiana. See, what did I tell you? He was said to be especially cruel, mistreating the children living under his care. That is, until one night in 1942, the children rose up against their evil caretaker and dragged his body to the nearby swamp after which he was never seen again. Okay, <laughs> it goes on and on. Um, I, I go back and read these things after the videos, but when I'm looking at these with you guys, I just want to get to looking at the pictures and watching the videos. So you can go back on the Spirit website and you can read that whole description for yourself later on. But for now, let's start looking at some pictures. So there is the six foot bog zombie animatronic. I want to see some closer pictures and I know as we get down the page we will see that. That actually looks pretty cool. There's a front view. There's a going to the side view. It looks like his knee bone is like sticking out. All right, let's see. There's another one. Um, there's a side view, a back view. Here we go. Here's the close-up of the face. And once again, he has the yellow eyes. Everybody this year has the glowing yellow eyes. Does the widow have the glowing yellow eyes? I don't remember. I think she was the last one that I looked at, and she... I don't remember. Anyways, all of them this year seem to have yellow glowing eyes. So, is there another picture here? Yeah, here's another one. All right, it's more of like a side angle here. Man, his, that guy's nose is like totally gone. Even some of the bone around the nose is gone. All right, let's go on back up here because I want to watch. Wait a minute, is there more? Oh, it's just a comparison that shows uh, how tall he would be compared to a six-foot guy. All right, so let's go back up here because I want to watch this video and I want to see how he sounds. Headphones on. Here we go. All right, he's got the gurgles going on. Okay. I gotta say, I expected he was going to start talking and saying some phrases. And as you saw, all he did was like gurgle and just make scary zombie sounds, which is kind of cool. I'm kind of glad they did that with him. I'm kind of glad they don't make every single one talk. I mean, he's supposed to be a zombie. He's supposed to just be chasing you very slowly and making zombie gurgly sounds. If anything... I would have expected him to say the word brains. However, if you remember, there is already an older spirit animatronic. Um, I can't think of what it is right offhand. You guys can tell me in the comments below. But um, but he says brains. You know, he's going after those brains. And I love him. I just can't remember what he's called now. I'm going to have to go back through my old videos. So, all right, guys. There's just a quick look here at the six-foot bog zombie animatronic. Not a whole lot of movement, the typical moving back and forth, but I do have to say, as a zombie, I like how when he moves back up or to the one side, he kind of falls into position instead of just moving slowly. That looks cool because you know, if there were no muscles, there'd be no joints holding those bones together. I'm out of here, peace. I told you to stay away. Oh my God. <laughs> 